You're watching Times TV and today we are at Wasan Dental Center. With me is the founding doctor, Siju, who has just completed 14 years in Oman today. So firstly, congratulations, doctor, on this huge achievement. Thank you. I would so. love to know a little bit about your journey, though. 14 years in Oman, how has it been? It's been really wonderful. and was We started really small, primarily focusing on general dentistry. It was at the year 2003, we started with two treatment centers. It was really difficult actually. First few cases, it took quite a while for them to get convinced that I could move the teeth and improve their smiles. Mm -hmm. Right, so what are the main facilities that you offer at Wasan? We have eight treatment centers, state of art equipped, right from the 3D imaging facility. What's that, 3D imaging? We, we take, it's similar like a CT scan we take for the, for the body, like mm -hmm. you know, we take for the jaws, which mainly we use it for the dental implants, we use it for the canine impactions case. And we have another facility which recently we got it approved, which only few clinics in Oman we have. Like you know, one is the sleep dentistry. Not that, sleep dentistry. Yeah. Patients, a lot of patients are very much scared of the dental procedures. Oh yes, I am one of them. I definitely am. <laughs> so we have a facility where you can, we can make you sleep, we get on all the procedures. Once we are done, you can just get up and... Are you serious? Sleeping throughout the procedure. Yes, yes, so absolutely. No, no, absolutely. This is particularly meant for the patients who have a fear of dentistry. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. So that's absolutely pain free. Even no, absolutely pain free. Okay. So, what else do you have apart from these that you offer to the customers? Earlier, we, the patient used to wait for a week for a crown. Now we can have, we can finish everything in a single sitting, you know, in an hour, we can deliver the crown. So, it's very efficient now, yeah? Absolutely. So right now what we see a trend in Oman is people when it comes to medical, not just dental, but like overall medical, they tend to travel to other countries such as India because it's cheaper and there are more options available. But do you see medical tourism coming to Oman any time in the future? There are many European destinations which still stay on top of the dental tourism like Spain, Holland, Poland, etc. Yeah. They still remain as top dental tourism destinations. I think Oman also could follow one of them. Yeah, but so have you attended Tanfeed? I'm sure you're aware of Tanfeed, right? The economic diversification plan. So in that, are they talking about medical tourism at all? They do mention, but as such, like actively any of these things coming up, like, no, over, over the years, the private sector has been developing quite a lot, actually. And so I'm sure they are also pl put playing a role in the developing the medical tourism facility as well. Right. Thank you so much, Dr. Siju. I've definitely learnt a lot today about dental hygiene and I think I'm a little less scared to come to a dentist now and probably get my cavity fixed after, I don't know, 10 years maybe. But yes, thank you again for speaking to us today and thank you for watching Times TV's interview. Thank you so much.